I am so tired, you say. Then rest. I am so bored, you say. Then do something exciting. I am so thirsty, you say. Then drink. Life is more simple than you imagine. Do not create complexity where there is none. Let go. Simply be. You don't have to have it all figured out. Enjoy this moment. It is all that is. Let go. Don't worry. All is well. You worry about the amount of time you spend with tech or the amount of money it would cost to have someone else do it. These messages are for you. Don't worry. There is no rule. I simply want you to connect with me. Why? Because I know you will be happier. My wish for you is happiness. Allow these messages this time to be for you, about you. Don't stress about putting things on YouTube four times a day. Especially while you're gone. When you stress, you are doing the opposite of the lessons. Let go. Invite flexibility. Invite flexibility. If you feel your life is out of balance, it is. If your body wants to move, move it. Amend your life so it suits you. Amend your day so it suits you. It's okay for you to change your mind. It's okay to make a new plan. It's okay for things to be different. You are not stuck. It's okay for things to be different. It's okay to respond to the moment, to what is and what is not. Don't worry. All is well. You are not Atlas. You are not Atlas. No one is. You are not Atlas holding the world on his shoulders. It is not your job. Stop trying to do it. The reason you embody, the reason everyone embodies is to enjoy and explore and be challenged by the physical experience. Invite that. To be in a physical experience, you must get out of your head more. You need more physical expression in your life. Whatever you choose is great. 
do anything you cannot do without a body. Draw more. Sing. Move. Eat. Talk. Touch. It doesn't matter. Just do more of it every day. You are not alone. And all is well. It's okay to be flexible. It's good to be flexible. Relax. Enjoy. Be less regimented. Bend to time. Do not insist that time bends to you. Let go. Be still. Enjoy. Take a day off. It's okay. Let go. Don't worry. All is well. Let go. Don't worry. All is well. Be at peace. What if peaceful pause were just for you? How would it be different? What do you want? What do you really want? Drink more water, eat more vegetables, let go, release, renew, move more. Move more in predictable and unpredictable ways. Love more. Love more in predictable and unpredictable ways. Be real. Be as authentic as you can muster. What do you want? What do you really, really want? Go for it. morning. This is Dr. Caroline Peterson, week eight of Peaceful Pause. I was thinking about how Peaceful Pause, one minute meditations that come out four times a day, is like the Islamic prayers, calling us back to connection calling us back to a place of reflection, peace. And also I was thinking about how I feel stress about it. I feel stress about the, the rigors of like getting all the technology in place and getting ahead because now I'll be out of town for a couple of weeks and I won't be able to come to the beach. And so I need to get all those videos done. And four times a day for 14 days is a lot of videos to get done in advance. And so I was just feeling like you know, there's so many, I, so the technology piece takes a lot of time. And is it really something that I'm benefiting from? Like, it's just like repetition. Like in the beginning, I was like, oh, this is neat because I'm learning how to use the technology and it's hard and I'm learning. So awesome. I can use it for other stuff too. But now it's just kind of like repetition. It's a lot of the same thing over and over again. That takes time and that is just the nature of things. So then Today, while I was meditating, Spirit was like, uh, excuse me, uh, 
You kind of forgot the whole point of this. <laughs> the whole point is to is to not be stressed. <laughs> the whole point is to come into reflection. And my lesson, part of my lesson that I'm learning with Peaceful Pause is the importance of being flexible. So I have a tendency to be very kind of regimented and strict and kind of like get things done. And so it's, if, if I make a decision, it's hard for me to like change it, even if it's also hard in a different way to persist with the original decision. And so I think today, part of my reflection and, and help has been that it's okay to take a step back and to not push myself to do four a day um, when it feels like, oh my gosh, that's so much. I don't want to do that. I would like to be moving more. I don't want to just sit in front of the computer all the time. Um, and so, and so I think that while I'm in Oregon, I'll probably just have one come out a day, something like that. And let this experience be for me. I think I have a real tendency to be like, I wanna be of service to others and I'm gonna do this to help others. And Spirit today was just like, uh, well, let's see. <laughs> Take a step back, this is about you. And it's okay to, it's okay to do what's right for you and not have this like imaginary other that you're serving front of mind. Spirit's like, uh, you're right there with you all the time and it's okay to take care of you. <laughs> things don't have to be so complicated. I don't know why we imagine things are so complicated. <sighs> Thanks for joining me in this peaceful pause. Week eight.